everybody, and welcome back to the Wattpad Book Club. I'm your host, Phoenix, and today I joined this other furry with me on this, uh, on this reading today. Their name is Sage. <laughs> hey, stop. You need to stop introducing me like this. Sorry. <laughs> you need to stop. You are damaging my, uh, my credibility. Bro, you, you literally have a, a hellhound as your profile picture. There's nothing helping your case. Shh. Like, <laughs> yeah. We don't talk about <laughs> yeah. It's not important. Yeah, like when I was up for trial for simping and then I proceeded to post more Vox stuff in this <laughs> You ruined my entire case. I had evidence piled up against people <laughs> and you just ruined it. And I'm just like, here's a picture of Vox, smash, and you're like, no! <laughs> you're like in court and you've got files and it's all just Vox and you're showing it to the court like, yeah, this my man. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> And it was like, Your Honor, can't you clearly see before the defendant that uh, th that they are brain rot dead? <laughs> you can I... uh, you can clearly see that they are not very Sigma. Yeah, <laughs> this is some beta ass behavior, Your Honor. <laughs> negative aura, negative riz. <laughs> well, we're about to find out about someone that has negative riz. Pr pretty oh. much both of them, because <laughs> they aggravated the shit out of us the last time we read. <laughs> I am so sure that it's going to be the exact same this time, and I'm not prepared. What? No! Adam and Lou are going to get their things together in, in these next chapters, <laughs> I think. One, one can hope, Phoenix. One can hope. Yeah, I have my emotional support gay uh, plushies with me, aka SMG4 and SMG3, so I, sh I should be able to handle this. <laughs> They're so ugly. They're, don't be mean to them, they're, they're sensitive. They're gonna curse it. If we have any chance of this working out fine, <laughs> they're gonna curse it. Fine, I'll face them away at least so they can't see it. <laughs> put them in jail. I can't- I can put them in the plush corner. Yeah, that's good All enough. Right. Yeah, okay. Alright, bye SMG3. Eh. Alright, he's in the corner now. Alright, what do we remember from this? Uh, um. Miscommunication, <laughs> the saga... Um, <laughs> Yelling, um, screaming, crying, pain. Alcohol, drinking... But uh, was the one that we made fun of with the Big Mac thing? <laughs> Big Mac? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Luke making fun of Adam for being a Big Mac. <laughs> Yeah. That was funny. Yeah, and then now uh, uh, Loot has quit the uh, the whole exorcist thing right now, so I guess we're gonna see what she's been up to for the past three months. Yeah. Let's go. All right. Do you want to still read for for Loot's POV? Yeah, I'll do Loot, and then you can do Adam since we're on that that oh. train already. Oh, I can I can do Adam. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I mean, we could take him in turns. Okay, it tucks hair behind the ear. <laughs> Gives De <laughs> Debbie Ryan look. <laughs> Not with the milkman, though. You stay away. You can have the milkman. I put that shit in D tier, bro. Okay. <laughs> 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 uh. Okay, so we're back with loot. Let's hope she can get her shit together. Something tells me it is not gonna be her getting her shit together. <laughs> Just a guess, though. Three months have gone by, and I no longer feel any emotions. That night with Adam broke me down harder than anything else on my life. Seeing him cry broke me harder than him yelling at me. I made my decision to leave the exorcist army. I knew that I... We couldn't fix it this time. The past week and a half, I've just laid on my bed. I have no motivation to do anything. Everything on the inside hurts. I spent most of my days sleeping, crying, or looking at old photos of me and Adam before the blowout. Look at but this photograph. I'm sorry. <laughs> Phoenix, shush. Every time I look, it makes me laugh. <laughs> go to jail. I will. I'll, I'll go right there after we're done. <laughs> okay, good. But today is the final day. I finally get up and move on. I take a shower and go put on my uniform. Oh yeah, I rummaged through my closet and put on normal clothes. 
been a while since I wore normal ass clothes. <laughs> Me. <laughs> As I leave my apartment and start walking down the promenade. Why do they keep saying promenade? Just say the street. Uh, what is a Big promenade? How you spell that shit again? I want to see what the actual definition or how to actually pronounce this shit. Promenade. Uh, a leisure walk or drive, especially in a public place for pleasure or display. <laughs> that is such a weird description. Pleasure or display. No, yeah, you're wow. right. That is kind of weird. <laughs> okay, well, we're walking down the pleasure or display <laughs> street. I will admit it was weird walking by myself and not with Adam. I shook my head. I need to move on. Move on from him. I don't really know where to head, so I just go to our usual spot. It was out his favorite milkshake place but i saw no harm in going myself i need something to do as i open the door i walk in i see him fuck 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 fuck, fuck I, say to <laughs> <laughs> I turn to leave and look through the store window to see when he leaves he looks rough he wasn't wearing his mask which was shocking his beard has grown out and he left it unshaven his hair was messed up like he just woke up. He has huge bags under his eyes. For a moment or two, I felt kind of bad. No loot, he's an asshole. He ruined their friendship. She watches as he pays for his shake and leaves the store, unnoticing loot by the window. I breathe a huge sigh of relief. I walk in and order my shake. Strawberry has always been my favorite. I need it to cheer me up. I pay and walk out of the store. I bump into someone. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean... I look up, and it's him. Adam, looking back at me. Oh, shit. Kiss We're already! Just done right. <laughs> <laughs> They're finally here. Make out. Yeah. Do it. <laughs> Push them closer together. <laughs> Drink from the same milkshake now. <gasps> oh my god, so romantic. <laughs> we just stare at each other for what felt like forever. Sorry, I'll leave, just forgot a straw, he says, whilst giving me a sluggish smile. I didn't know what to say, so I just stood there, frozen. He gave me a weird look, opening his mouth like he was going to say something, but just turned around and walked away. I could feel my eyes start to swell up. This hurt. This hurt so bad. We were acting like total strangers to each other. I need to do something. I needed anything to get away from this feeling. I marched down the street, not caring where I ended up, but I needed to let out a lot of anger, sadness, and pain. As I'm walking, I sit down on a bench. I didn't notice what I was doing, but I can feel my face turn blood red from anger and regret. All of a sudden, I hear a pair of douchebags laughing behind me. One of them sit right next to me and stretched him around me. Hey, hot stuff. <laughs> what are you doing out here all alone? Before he finishes, I punch him square in the face. Yeah, get him! Nobody ever says hot stuff. That is so weird. <laughs> no, I know what. For now, I I will be saying that every time I see Cameron. <laughs> oh, fair enough. As yeah. long as it's Cameron and not like Elf or something. Oh, hey, yeah, hot I'm... stuff. When that video gonna be ready? <laughs> I think Elf would be like, "Oh, uh, are you good?" <laughs> Are you drunk? Are you, yeah, they're like, are you... Are you mentally okay? <laughs> hmm, do you need to go back in your cell? Uh, yeah, <laughs> you see me march my ass back in there. <laughs> <laughs> I, I see the golden angel blood fall out of his nose, but I kept going, wailing on him over and over, letting out all of my anger on his stupid fucking face. Over and over, I hit him. It takes five people to pull me off of him. How'd that taste, you little bitch? Is that a Lucifer reference? Ooh. My, uh, my heart just fluttered. <laughs> <laughs> just got, uh, butterflies in my stomach. <clears throat> Maybe I when say, I see a TV! <laughs> Phoenix, no! Well, you got to say something, like, sus? Why can't I? Say something sus. Because you say something sus all the time. I never say anything sus. What do you, what do you mean by that? 
What do you What do you mean by that? <laughs> Dude, I don't believe your ass. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> let's uh, move on from this topic. I don't want to talk about this anymore. <laughs> I learned that one from Adam. Fuck, why am I still thinking about him? God fucking fuck, that is a sentence. <laughs> I pull myself off the other angels holding me and start to walk away. I just need to go home already. But all of a sudden, a big tall motherfucker just appears in front of me. Fuck, it was Sarah. Loot, we need to talk. Damn. Womp <laughs> womp. <laughs> that is negative riz for loot. Yeah. And just standing there while Adam bumps into her, like, can you at least say something? Yeah. So much Riz. <laughs> she doesn't know what to do with it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Adam POV. If he doesn't do something good, I'm going to kill myself. I mean, uh, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm starting to get- so forward. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I think I'm gonna- I think I'm starting to get over her. I only- Thought about her six out of seven days this week, so I'm making progress, I guess. I saw her earlier today, and I couldn't stomach talking to her. Not after what she had done to me. But I had to get to training, as the usual extermination was coming up pretty soon. It was nice to focus on something else that wasn't her for once. I think I'm slowly moving on. No, that's not supposed to happen! <laughs> no, you need to think about her seven out of seven days this week, not six. Yeah, get your shit together, Adam. <laughs> <laughs> get your ass back to the milkshake store and slurp that milkshake with Luke. <laughs> <laughs> the milkshake store, not the diner, the milkshake. <laughs> <laughs> they only sell well, milkshake. <laughs> well, I don't know about you, but we don't have diners in the UK, so... <gasps> you don't? No. That's so... That's so sad. Where do you get, like, a good breakfast from? Home. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> My bad. <laughs> <laughs> I was a few minutes late after the fiasco from earlier. I opened the doors to the training room as hundreds of eyes look over at me. I s slowly flew over to the podium and gave the daily announcements. First in the agenda, we're getting a we're getting new angelic spears this week. A few tears came from that announcement. Second, I am I will not be naming a new lieutenant until after the extermination at the very least. A few unhappy groans and boos came from that one. The girls were unhappy and shocked by the news of loot quitting. She was the one that usually trained them. I was I was more I was more of the planner. A good Chuck of the girls blame me for her leaving. Well, no shit, I would too. I mean, those dumb bitches. Yeah, me too. It is kind of your fault. Like, you're my man, but also... <laughs> <laughs> those dumb bitches don't realize I have ears as well. It's whatever. It's whatever. Like, I give a rat's ass what they think. I don't know when I'll announce a new lieutenant. As after loot, I didn't think I could trust anyone else again. Damn. <laughs> Womp womp. Yeah, womp womp. <laughs> Get over yourself. <laughs> First, Lilith left for that no good short fucking piece of shit clown ass fuck face. And then my poor Eve. God fuck, why did you eat that fucking apple, Eve? It pains me to this day that fucking fruit is the reason she's not up here with me. The reason I fell in love with Lou in the first place. God, I fucking hate my life. <laughs> Well, you don't have to suffer anymore, buddy, because you're going to die during extermination day, man. Up top. <laughs> I think that that is genuinely the best paragraph in this entire book so far. <laughs> <laughs> I head to my office to do fucking paperwork or whatever. Something to get my mind off of everything, and I fucking hate paperwork. Loot usually does it. Here I go again, thinking about her. I punch the wall as hard- Oh my god, he's so- He's, he's just a baby girl just punching holes in walls. He's just a little guy. <laughs> Stop insulting him, he's doing the best he can. Obviously it's not enough. <laughs> yeah. I punch the wall as hard as I can, creating a big ass hole in it. Who cares, not my problem. I'll just blame it on one of the bitches outside. A few minutes go by and I hear a knock at my door. Come in, I groan as I, as I say it. A few of the top exorcists, the few I actually knew the names of, and the 
and the group that I would eventually pick for my new lieutenant from walked in lined up side by side. Um, what's wrong? I said, raising an eyebrow. They all look at each other, not knowing who should be the one to speak. We want to know what's wrong with you, sir. One of them spoke up. Yeah, what happened? Yeah, what happened to Loot? Another spoke. That is none of your damn business. That's what's up, I reply with a snarky tone. Sir, my apologies, but you're extra bitchy today. <laughs> I wish I could say that. I'm going to say that to you from now on. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. Well, I'm sorry if my attitude isn't up to your standards, I say sarcastically. Sir, just please tell us. Why, so you bitches can spread the word? Hell no. Sir, we're your closest exorcists. What you say stays between us. Just get out before I get a bigger migraine than I already have. But none of them moved. They all looked at each other and back at me. We aren't leaving, sir. It's a direct order. Leave right fucking now. Still, they just stood there and stared at me. Again, sir, we aren't leaving until we know what happened between you and Lu She didn't love me back, okay? I said, damn. D drama. I <laughs> yell <laughs> <laughs> as I cut them off. The room fell silent. Fell silent. All the exorcists looked puzzled. I loved her. I told her my feelings. She said no. We got into a big fight and she quit. I broke the silence, then tearing up. And now I don't know what to do to have- I had to replace her and no one could ever do that. I love- no. I love her and it still hurts so I'll never be able to have her. I put- my my head on my desk as tears slowly fall down my face. The exorcists don't say a word. They all they all move to huddle around me. <laughs> what are you bitches doing? I asked. One by one, all the girls wrapped their arms around me into a giant group hug. We're sorry, sir. They all say one by one. I sat there taking it all in. Thank you, girls. I needed this so bad. I say as as I hug them back. Oh. <laughs> so wait, wait, did you see this one comment at the bottom? It was like, it's giving apology tour. <laughs> <laughs> wait, really? Yeah, by uh, Swifty. <laughs> it's giving. Oh, I don't see it anywhere. Oh. Oh, I see it. I see it. <laughs> it's giving. Um, it's giving apology tour. No. <laughs> that just makes me even more sad. <laughs> Adam goes, have you seen those fake screenshots or something? There's an artist on Twitter that's doing apology door screenshots, but it's Adam and Lou instead. <gasps> I need that! <laughs> I'll send it to you if oh. I can find it after we've done with this. Yeah, oh, please do. Is it Lou singing on stage or is it Adam? Adam seeing Lou on stage. <gasps> awesome. <laughs> I think it might be based off of this comic, actually. <laughs> Oh my god, we're watching, like, we're, we're unfolding everything. <laughs> yeah, detective work, we're doing this shit. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> right, we're back with Lou. Please, please work it out. <laughs> Go and see him. <laughs> Great. Not only did I have to deal with everything going on with my life now, I have to deal with Sarah's shit. Sarah teleports me and herself to a meeting room. This was going to be awful. She's gonna give me one of those disappointed parent talks. She guides me to a seat and she sits on the opposite side. She looks visibly frustrated, but at this point I don't really care. But I still need to be respectful. What is this about, ma'am? I ask. She gives me a very serious and deadly look. You know what this is about, Luke? You almost killed someone today. She said, as if she doesn't go down and exterminate millions of people every year. <laughs> yeah, basically. Like, what's one angel gonna do? Let's be for real. Yeah. <laughs> With all due respect, he had it come in. Are you sure you usually don't act like this, Lou? I'm fine, ma'am, I say, breaking eye contact with her. She seems to know I was bluffing as she raised one of her eyebrows. Loot, you know lying is a sin, she said, as a half-hearted threat. What do you want from me, ma'am? Tell me the truth. 
something is going on with you. I take a deep breath. Did I really want to tell Sarah of all people? Like, would she understand? Has she even been in a relationship in the last ten years? <laughs> <laughs> that is so savage. I haven't even been in a relationship in the last 10,000 years, damn. It, it's a guy, I say as I reply. Oh, that's interesting. I wasn't expecting you to have boy trouble. She giggles as she responds. Yeah, I know, a shocker. Well, what's wrong? I'm sure I could help. I had a, a guy <laughs> confessed his feelings to me. <laughs> I caught myself. I didn't want to tell Sarah it was Adam. Well, what's the issue? I rejected him, but I don't know if it was the right or the wrong choice. Hmm, that is quite the dilemma, she said. She sat there thinking for a moment before finally speaking. Well, do you love him? It's not you like say yes. that I don't. <laughs> yeah, just, just go, yeah! <laughs> It's not that I don't know what the rest of heaven would think about us, I finally admit. Well, who is it? I'm sure it's not that bad, she said with a slight smile. It's Adam. I pause for a moment. It's Adam, I say. I could feel my face turning red. Sarah sat there for a moment. She seemed shocked, but she eventually regained her composure. Do you love him? She again asked. I sat at a loss for words. Did she not hear what I just said? I swear, she's crazy. But I had no idea how to respond. Yes, I admitted, giving a sigh of relief as it felt good to say it out loud. Yeah! Finally! <laughs> yes, we're not in the denial stage anymore. <laughs> then, excuse my language, who the hell cares what other people think then? She gave out a little chuckle. Yes, Sarah! Go, oh, go! Fucking base Sarah right now. <laughs> Plus 10,000 aura, Sarah. <laughs> Sarah's us right now. You're like, I'm picking our part, but who the fuck cares? Get together right here. Mm, I'm sorry for what I'm about to say, but who gives a shit? <laughs> <laughs> I sat there astonished. Did it really not matter to heaven? But he's the first fucking man. I'm just some common slut, right? Ooh. <laughs> wow, that is crazy. Wow, <laughs> crazy. I was crazy once. Was. They put me in a room, a rubber room, a rubber room with rats. rats the rats made me crazy. Crazy. <laughs> crazy. <laughs> oh but God. <laughs> and I'm just, just what? He is a first man, but that doesn't make him any more special than any other angels here. She paused for a moment. If I were you, I would track him down before it's too late, she added on. Sarah is so based right now. Sarah's my new favourite character, guys. <laughs> I sat up from my seat and ran out of the meeting room. I had no idea where to go, but I had to find Adam. So many thoughts were going through my head all at once. I love him, I really do. He needs to know, even if he never wants to talk to me again. My whole view flipped right upside down after meeting with Sarah. She was right. Yeah, no shit, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Took you this long. Congratulations, do you want a medal? Yay! <laughs> I swear Ooh, to fucking god, we're gonna... if this doesn't... Okay, okay, I can do this. I can <laughs> contain my composure. Okay. <laughs> you can do this, Phoenix. You can do this. I'm like Sarah in, at the end of like episode six, where she's trying to like like keep her shit together. <laughs> right now. Yeah, where she's brushing her hair back and she's like taking a deep breath. Yeah, she's like, all right, I can I can get through this meeting. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Adam POV. I lazily opened the door to my house. My back was killing me after the whole emotional shit with the exorcist. I actually did some training. I slowly walked to my room and changed out of my robe I was wearing. I- I- oh, I put on. So I was like, I butt on? <laughs> <laughs> I butt on. <laughs> I put on a black shirt with boxers and headed to the bathroom. When I turned the light on, I looked- I gave myself a good look in the mirror. Holy fuck, I look awful. <laughs> I haven't been taking care of myself these last few months. I haven't shaved my beard since that night, and my- 
The hair is a curly mess. But first, I'll take a shower. The first one in two weeks! You fucking stink, oh, bro. Oh. <laughs> Dad's just, just giving him the hug. We're like, oh my fucking. We <laughs> got pegs on the noses. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, when he was doing I'm... training and stuff, he probably smells like a fucking pig right now. Adam, listen, I love you so much, but please take a shower. <laughs> yeah, he's stinky. <laughs> uh oh, stinky. <laughs> <laughs> when I finished up, I finally shaved, leaving the little stubble on the edge of my shin. I headed to my bed while also combing my combing my knotted hair up. Yeah, coma. Yeah, I'm so smart. Once I was finished, <laughs> I was I was ready for bed. My bed was more than like a nest. I get there, he nests. Is this an omega alpha thing? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I just found it more comfortable that way. He, this is an omega fan fiction. <laughs> As I curled up in a ball, everything just hit me at once. All the trauma coming back right at that moment. Lilith leaving. My poor Abel died. That fucking apple. All my attempts to move on with different bitches that never seemed to work. I just lay there, tears streaming down my face. I had no control of it. I must have fallen asleep since I woke up at 5 a.m. My normal waking time. I slump up as I go put on my my ropes. <laughs> I love Whoa! On ropes. <laughs> I didn't know it was this kind of book. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> I'm surprised you missed that. No, was... My brain's losing oxygen a little bit, I think. <laughs> you just skipped right past that. I was like, whoa, hold up a minute. <laughs> I, I go to check my phone. I don't usually get notifications because um, I don't fucking care to know why, why I don't know, I guess. As I check, I see a missed call from Blutes. <laughs> My baby girl over loot? <laughs> <laughs> My baby girl? I- I- uh, if I, holy fucking shitballs. I- Do I- Do I fucking do here? She called me! Why? My heart is pounding. I feel like my entire body is shaking. I pause for a moment before slowly opening my phone and to call her back. I can't believe I'm fucking doing this. <laughs> the phone rings for a moment. A part of me was hoping she picks up while the other hopes she doesn't. Hello? I hear as she picks up the phone. Um, hey, Lou, you called me? I said sheepishly. There an awkward silence for a few moments before she spoke again. I want to talk with you, Adam. She finally responds. I can hear my my breathing pick up as they start hypoventilating. Uh, uh, ab about what? I stutter. It's too much to talk in the phone. Can we meet at our usual spot? Yeah, I, I can do that. Okay, meet you there in an hour. Oh my god, they're getting to go on a date! Yay! Yeah. Yippee! 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 <laughs> I, every time you say that, I can see the little, like, the little autism creature with the big ass eyes and, and the confetti. Yeah, guys, that's, that's my face reveal. I'm actually just the autism creature behind this right <gasps> oh now. Oh my god! I had no idea. Oh, that sounded very back. <laughs> oh shit, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to like that. <laughs> No, no, no. It's so funny. <laughs> oh, no. You're right. I oh, should be apologizing. Wow. I was right. You are. <laughs> oh, wow. I had no idea. <laughs> she hangs up the phone before I can respond. It was the first time I heard her voice in three months. That thought sent me a shiver down my spine. It's in 35 minutes since that phone call, and I have yet to move. My thoughts are overwhelming me, wondering what she could possibly want. Before I can get lost in my thoughts, even more, I glance at the clock on my wall and- HOLY f- f I almost burped at the fu- <laughs> That would have been a good censorship, you just burp at curse words. That's gonna be like on your soundboard, you'd have to make a recording of you burping so that you can censor out all the swear words with it. I was about to say, like, what am I gonna burp that I'm gonna be have it recorded? I'm like, I burp at least once a stream. <laughs> this is this is not a challenge. I should this get a is, soundboard uh, and it's just be burping. <laughs> this is very regular for us, just you burping. Yeah. Yeah, I I see you guys being like, oh, bless you. I'm like, I didn't sneeze. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because. 
at first when I first joined your streams and you just kept on burping, I was like, what is this a battle? <laughs> but no, I'm used to it. Yeah, you're like, what are we even talking about? What are we even <laughs> talking <laughs> about? <laughs> oh, oh, uh, fuck. Holy fuck, I'm gonna be late. I fly out of my house and rush over and rush my way over there. I land in front of the establishment and I glance through the main window. I see you're sitting there waiting for me in our usual spot. I take a deep breath as my hands start to shake as I go and open the door. Wait, shit. I almost forgot to put on my mask. Okay, now. We're good. Uh, yep, definitely. It's totally fine. I'm def- I'm fine. This is gonna end up so well. <laughs> Adam is me right now. I have a panic attack every fucking time I have to go in public. <laughs> yep, this is fine. This is totally fine. I'm gonna end up so well. Yeah. So real. J just gonna go to aisle 12. Get my Arizona iced tea, go get the hamburger buns, everything's fine, you got your script for the cashier, it's- everything's gonna be fine. <laughs> yeah, me anytime I have to check out at Attila and actually talk to someone, I'm like, oh shit. Yeah. <laughs> ah shit, here we go again. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> I finally grow a pair and open the door. She looks up right at me as I gingerly walk over and take a seat across from her. Staring into her eyes, I feel- I get mortified memories of the night at the garden. Whatever she wants better be fucking worth it. The fuck do you want? <laughs> I ask, bre breaking the silence. She clears her throat. Adam, there's something I need to tell you. Better be quick. This sh there's shit I need to get done today, bitch. Why are you being so mean? <laughs> Stop being a big meanie! She just Stop. wants to tell you how much she loves you! Yeah. <laughs> Well, remember the night in the gardens? Mm, let me think. Oh yeah, how could I forget the night where you shattered my heart in a million goddamn pieces? I'm actually like such an asshole towards her. Serves her right. Well, when you asked me if I loved you, I said no. It, I wasn't being entirely truthful. The fuck are you on about? <laughs> well, sir. She paused for a moment, so calling me sir, even though she doesn't work for me anymore. She reaches over and puts her hand on top of mine! <gasps> <gasps> I, I love you. Are you fucking serious? <laughs> I, I burst out loud in a noxious laugh. She gives me a weird look. Wait, you're being for real? I add- I added on a- I added on, looking right at her. Yes, is that not what you wanted? She- she asks. You're fucking crazy. <laughs> not the gaslighting. <laughs> I said they set up to go to leave. I make- I make it out the door and start walking down the street when I hear someone running after me. Adam, wait, please. She grabs my hand and pulls me around to face her. I thought you wanted me, she asked. I take a deep breath, trying not to blow up in front of everyone in fucking heaven. I did loot, I really did. But that was but that was before you broke my heart, ghosting me for three months, and then come out of the blue and change your fucking mind right when I was trying to move on. The I just let it all out in there. That's not fair, sir. You didn't contact me either. Do you think I didn't want to? I stared at my phone every night wondering if it was gonna be the day I should call. I all it all went silent as we looked at each other. I'm tired of these- I'm tired of playing these games. I'm tired of always fighting with you, Loot. M me too, sir. Me too. W wait, who's talking? <laughs> I think... Uh... Oh, Adam. Okay. Let's just- um. <laughs> I was like, let's go to my place. I need to talk to you in private. She agreed and we set off and flew back over to my house. Once we enter, she follows me to to my room, where I take off my mask and look her with my real face. I can't deal with another woman leaving me loot. I started. Lilith, Eve, you. You once. I can't take it anymore. Sir, I promise I won't leave it. What changed your mind? I asked, cutting her off. What do you mean? She responded. I mean, why do you love me now and not three months ago? I spoke to Sarah and of oh, Sarah, and she helped me find my real feelings for you. 
What about Heaven's view on us that you care so much? Fuck Heaven's view. <laughs> yeah, yeah, fuck the patriarchy. <laughs> Get down, Mr. President. <laughs> <laughs> fuck Heaven's view. I only care about you now. Funny how you didn't trust me when I said that. Sir, please. I just... I just don't... I just want to make to move on with my life with you and it romantically or not. I need you, sir. Yes! 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 <laughs> That's the good shit. Give yeah. me more. Yeah. <laughs> we're, we're like eating good right now. We're just like... <laughs> Hungry. Feed me more. <laughs> we're holding out our bowls like, Please, sir, I want some more. <laughs> <laughs> I froze there for a moment. Those words pulling my heartstrings like never before. Okay, then, I said as I walked past her and reached for something in my closet. What are you doing, sir? She asked. Here it is. I pull out loose. Why do you have that? <laughs> loose yeah, why do I give it to you? <laughs> yeah. Loose exorcist uniform She turns that she turned into me. Oh, she turned it in. She's oh. like, I'm fucking done with this shit. Damn, if we'd only just paid attention for like two more seconds, we would have got the answer. Yeah. <laughs> If only we didn't jump the gun immediately. <laughs> Good thing we didn't overreact. <laughs> Here, come be my lieutenant again, and I'll show you that- and show me that I can trust you again. She hesitates for a minute before grabbing the uniform. Y yes, sir. She begins to walk out of the room. Oh, loot. One more thing? Y yes, sir. She looks back quickly. I'm glad to be friends again. I offer my hand and she shakes it somberly. Before I could add in further dialogue, she speeds out of my room. See you tomorrow, sir. I hear her yell in a raspy voice. I think I did the right decision, even though I, f I fucking love her, and I still do. I don't want to take a chance with and someone else leaving again. Never again. Damn. Damn. Trauma! Not cool. <laughs> <laughs> I keep getting these adverts. Damn. Buy a Tesla okay. today. Do you even have Teslas? Do we have Teslas? I mean, like, do you have like different types of like car manufacturers over there? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey, a random question, but do you have Teslas? <laughs> well, I mean, I didn't well. know if you had like Fords and like and and like Toyotas and shit. I didn't know if you like you had your own little special brand of cars. I didn't know. Do the I have UK a brand new car. <laughs> yeah, I, I know, we just... have a Toyota at home, so yeah, we 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 do. Okay, well, I did. I just needed to know the question, you know. <laughs> yeah, I I agree. It was very important. Yeah, <laughs> I very much understand. <laughs> I'm understanding British culture every every time I talk to you. <laughs> It's good you are becoming a British citizen and you don't even realize it. Yeah, I'm gonna go over there. I'm gonna speak fluent British. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> One thing, keep those damn plushies <laughs> over there. I show up at your door and I have like a, like a suitcase full of them that just gets like like dumped on you. No, not those. Ugly thing. <laughs> What's wrong? Half of them are squishmallows. Oh, that's fine. Yeah. yeah you no. can you can dump like a rainbow unicorn on me, but just not like a thirty-year-old man. Oh, he's not thirty. <laughs> he's twenty-five. He's, yeah, it's twenty-five. Five years, Phoenix. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> he, he's not your little baby. He's a grown-ass man living a grown-ass life. I'm sorry. <laughs> Dude, it's so weird to me that, like, th this- the creator of my favorite little show that I watch is, like, maybe just- like, he's only, like, three or four years older than me. And th that's crazy to think of. Like, same generation, I, on a different path, you know? I genuinely thought you were just about to tell me the creator was three or four years old and just stopped there. <laughs> I was like, yeah, that is crazy, Phoenix. <laughs> Yeah, they've been making content for like 10 years and they're only three, that's crazy. <laughs> yeah, this, these videos have been around for like 10, 15 years, whatever, and then this guy's just like three or something, I don't know. 
I mean, he could be ten, but he's just a bit extra small. <laughs> He's, he's, okay. he's, he's one he's one inch tall. <laughs> he, he is one McDonald's sauce packet long. <laughs> <laughs> that was a that was a bit mean. I'm sorry, sorry to <laughs> the SMG four fans out there, aka only Phoenix. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Being ridiculed at every turn. <laughs> yeah, every corner I'm just there like bam, get dunked on. <laughs> That's okay. it. When the wheel gets made, we're putting SNG34 on, on the wheel, and you're not gonna stop me no! from doing that. It's uh -oh. only one option, right? No. -uh. Yeah, because there, you is mean a chance, there is a chance that it could land on that, and I will be stuck here reading about 25 year olds. <laughs> hey, th at least they're adults, you know? It could be worse. <laughs> That one fanfiction stream that you did of SMG3 and SMG4 traumatized me. What's wrong with it, bro? The images! Bro, that is it not was... my fault. I didn't make those images. They made that, and they decided to, to grace our eyes with those images. <laughs> but you decided to read it publicly on stream. Yeah, and it was a great time. <laughs> <laughs> <Awesome>. <laughs> It was traumatic, Phoenix. You, know you ruined lives that day. I did ruin life. You ruined my life. Elf's probably life. Luke's <laughs> and probably Elf's. Yeah. For a second, I, I didn't think you were talking about Gamer Luke. I thought you were talking about the, the, the SMG4 Luke. And I'm like, damn, I didn't know it went that deep. <laughs> There's an SMG4 character called Luke. Dude, I mean, the, the creator of SNG4 is literally named Luke, and I can't pronounce the last name to, uh, to save my damn life, but... Luke the four-year-old, got it. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Okay. <laughs> Loot point of view. Let's see if we can try and get something out of this. Yeah, we better get some shit out of this, or I'm suing. <laughs> 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 he, he rejected me. He flat out rejected me. But he did want to be friends again, so it was all worth it, right? I say to myself in the mirror. Yeah, keep gaslighting yourself, I'm... loot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, way, way to be in denial again. Yeah, denial is a river in Egypt. <laughs> Your husband is gay! <laughs> <laughs> a single tear fell down my face. Stop being such a bitch, Luke. Stop, I tell myself, stopping myself from shedding any more tears. God, you're so fucking stupid. Why didn't you just say yes when he asked you originally? I pound my fist against the wall. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Okay, Leon. That, that's so me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, 11037. <laughs> I don't know what that voice was. Um, hey, cut actually. that out, guys. Cut that out, that was so embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> a sound from my phone broke me from my thoughts. I walk over and check and it was a message from Adam. Hey Danger Tits, you're almost done. We need to get to training, bitch. <laughs> um, okay. Oh, so romantic. <laughs> <laughs> wow, <laughs> at least ask me out to dinner first. <laughs> Yep, I'll be out in a minute, sir, I reply. It was my first training back after he asked me to be his lieutenant. I was nervous. I hadn't really kept up with any of the girls or the upcoming extermination since I left. I leave my apartment and head outside where Adam was waiting for her. Finally, bitch, he said playfully. <laughs> Sorry, sir. I glance up at him. I'm just busting your ball. <laughs> Go in. <laughs> That is... Wow, I'm using that from now on. <laughs> we walked down the promenade like nothing happened between us. He went on and talked about stuff. I was only paying attention. I just couldn't stop thinking about how he pushed past what happened. I mean, I still don't understand why he didn't accept me when I confessed to him. Did he not love me anymore? Was I not enough? I could feel another tear trickle down my face. Luckily, I had my mask on. God, I love him so much. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> but it was hard. 
and it still is to show how much I do. But I guess if being his friend is the way to show it to him, well, damn it, I will be the best friend ever. I wish I could go back to that night just to get a chance to slap myself. I can't stop thinking how I threw it away because of my insecurities. Oh, cheer up, babe. Everything is back to the way it was, he said, grabbing my chin and making me look at him. Oh, it's hot. Whoa. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Easy on the brakes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, back to normal, right, sir? I reply. Well, anyway, you got a lot of paperwork to do when we get there, he said with a grin. Great, I say with a sigh. He looks at me. I'm just fucking with you, dude. He lets out a laugh. I let out a little giggle to make him happy. A few minutes later, we arrive at the training centre and Adam heads towards his office. See you at lunch, bitch, he says, closing the door. <laughs> a few are... He just loves calling her a bitch. Yeah. You need to get a new term, like something like... I don't know, dear, sweetie. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think danger titch works out fine. Yeah. Yeah, a, few, a few hours go by and it was nice to get back into action. I talked to some of the girls and they told me how Adam was after I left and fuck I feel bad. But hell, it's time for lunch with Adam. I put my sword away and head over to his office. I open the door and Adam is there with two brown bags. Whoa, hey Con, I'm eating lunch today, he said with a grin. Oh dear. <laughs> <laughs> you made lunch, are you sure? I replied with a chuckle. Uh, yeah, Dickmaster is also the cook master. <laughs> I highly doubt that, sir. I take the bag from him and sit on the opposite side where my desk was. We sat and ate in silence for a few minutes. Sorry, this is so weird, Adam said out of the blue. It's fine, sir, just give it a few days, I reply. Yeah, I guess, but loot, he reaches <gasps> over and takes Sorry. my hand. Did Jim's you just so... burp? No, I gasped out loud. I was like, he's taking her hand? <laughs> oh, you burped and I just moved on from it. <laughs> no, it was like an audible gasp. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> that makes more sense. Well, actually, the burping makes more sense, but... Yeah, I guess, but Lou, he reaches over and takes my hand and looks into my eyes. I know what you're feeling, and trust me, I'm feeling it too, but this is how it's gotta be. I need you. <gasps> <laughs> I stopped for a moment, but I can't have you, and I can't have anyone. <sighs> I understand, sir. It's fine, I get what you're feeling, I replied. I lied plainly. He pulls his hand away, and I whimper to myself as he does. He continues eating until a thought popped in my head. Do you think you'll ever be in a relationship again, sir? I asked. Probably not. Oh, no! Killing damn myself. It. Killing, it. Killing myself right now. <laughs> Ending it all right now. Yep, on stream. Tonight at 7. No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Outro music starts playing. Yeah. <laughs> Who's gonna edit this video for me? <laughs> he shrugged. Shot through the heart after he said that. Excuse me, I need to use the bathroom. I all but ran out of his office holding tears back as I needed some air. God, I regret it so much. I regret not telling him sooner. I regret not answering truthfully when he asked. I regret everything. I stared at myself through the bathroom mirror, the reflection of which showed a pathetic loser idiot. After my emotional breakdown, as some would call, I return to Adam's office to finish up lunch with him. As I walk in, I see Adam holding something. I can't make out what it is. What is that, sir? I ask, my voice still a little raspy from crying. Nothing. Just a picture, he said, putting in a drawer and closing it. Sorry to cut our term early, Danger Tits, but Sarah called me in for a meeting, so I gotta get going. He puts a hand on my shoulder and gives me a re reassuring smile. <gasps> they touched. So hot. <laughs> <laughs> Did you just say that's so hot? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> You're imagining this being Vox, aren't you? So what if I'm getting some ideas for my own fanfiction, man? I'm just leave me alone. You're you're magpieing. I'm doing what? 
Magpieing. What the fuck is that? <laughs> it's a bird, a magpie. It steals shiny things. Oh, okay. I thought I thought it was like some fucking crazy loot shit that you were saying. I'm like, whoa. <laughs> It's a crazy <laughs> accusation. <laughs> Do you not have magpies in America? Well, I, don't, I don't even know what this thing looks like. You said magpies? Yeah, mag... I. Oh, I've never it's... seen this thing before. Damn! Wow, okay, it's well... It's cute! I've just never seen it before. Well, have you ever heard, like, the story of... The woman who got her eyes pecked out because she had a pie and there was like magpies floating all around her. Ooh, I don't like that at <laughs> all. <laughs> They're not very cute at all. They're a bit aggressive, actually. Oh, damn. <laughs> he walks out and I'm all alone in his office. As I go to sit at my desk to finish my lunch curiosity gets the better of me. I go over and pull out the drawer and grabbed the picture that Adam was looking at. The picture was of us on my first day as his lieutenant. A soft smile appeared on my face as I remembered, but that smile soon faded into tears. God, why is this so hard? I curl up into my knees and just look at the photo for what felt like hours. It was just us smiling. Why can't it be like that again? Damn. Adam, I need you to get your shit together, bro. You've been alive when for how long? <laughs> When we thought in the last chapter with Loot that she was going to confess her feelings and he was going to be like, Yeah, I love you back too. It wasn't. <laughs> uh, I'm going to kill I'm, I'm gonna kill both of them. I'm gonna <laughs> <laughs> this, this story keeps on giving us false hope. We're like, yeah! And then the next chapter we're like, oh. Yeah. Why, watch it do this. We're going to get like a little bit of like a cliffhanger uh, love thing at the end of this one. And then we're going to be like, yes! Our hope in, in, in society is back! <laughs> Yay, we have our hope back. Dang a yeah. romper do 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 Junko must be behind all of this. Oh my god, maybe that's why we're feeling such despair. Yeah, she keeps giving us all this hope only to crumble it with despair. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, this better this last fucking chapter I read better be fucking good or else I'm gonna I don't know. Punch my plushie, I guess? I don't know. <laughs> yes, please punch the plushie. He deserves it. No, he's just a little guy. I can't be mean to a little guy. Him you pets. keep calling him a little guy, but he's, bro, he's 25. Like bro, he's literally a little guy. He's in plush form. <laughs> that doesn't excuse the fact that it has a beard. No, this one doesn't. The SMG3? No, oh. three has a beard. Four does not have a beard. I am going to be 100% honest <laughs> with you right now. I'm not yeah. keeping track. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, wah wah. Say so just being mean to me. <laughs> Stop being such a big meanie. <laughs> so be, I'm just a little guy. <laughs> I've only had SMG3 and SMG4 for one day. But if anything ever happened to them, I would kill everyone in this office and then kill myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, oh fuck. Uh, okay. Well, <laughs> well, today turned out better than I expected. Danger Tits and I are getting back on the same page, and today was the first day I haven't cried in three months. Progress! But I had to cut her lunch short when Sarah bitch's ass called me in for a meeting. What could that bitch possibly want now? Watch, she's like, so, about you and Lou? he's like, huh? <laughs> yeah, she's like, so, how'd it go? Yeah, and he's like, what the fuck are you talking about? She's like, oh, shit. <laughs> Sarah is us right now. <laughs> yeah. I head towards her office, like, which it was halfway across fucking heaven. But I eventually get there and knock on the door to the meeting room. Come on in, Adam, I hear her say. I slam the door open and take a seat. The fuck do you want, Sarah? I'm busy. Busy with your lieutenant? She smirked, raising an eyebrow. Oh, <gasps> she is us. <laughs> she really is us. We're like, oh, really? She, she, she just like me. She just like me for real, for real. <laughs> she, she just like me for real. <laughs> I, what? I, uh, huh? 
No, why would you say- Huh? I, I blush a little. I was just kidding, Adam, she said with a chuckle. Anyway, I called you here for a reason, Adam. Spit it out already, jeez. I reply. In this year's extermination, she gagged upon saying the word. I don't want you or the any exorcists attacking any overlords. But, but why? I whined. They actually put up a fight so it's more satisfying when we kill them. Okay. Anyway, we've been informed that they're able to get their hands on angelic steel. How? That's nothing for you to worry about, but stay clear of them, got it? She said in a stern voice. Yeah, yeah, whatever you- Yeah, yeah, whatever. Can I leave now? She nodded and I left. What? How are you being like, what? How do they get their hands on a giant- You guys will just leave the fucking weapons behind when you guys are done with it. You don't even bother taking it back with you. Yeah, I, w I was like kind of wondering if this is the extermination where Adam dies in, like, season one. And I was like, oh my god, no, this book's gonna end with Adam dying. Damn. Or maybe it will, we don't know. Adam Please no. with a sad ending. <laughs> No, I was already very upset when he did die. I didn't get over now it for can, a while. Now, now you gotta relive it. <laughs> no! <laughs> she nodded and I left. Man, that was so fucking lame. Killing overlords were the most fun. God damn it. As I get ready to fly back to the training, this annoying ass voice comes from behind me. Fuck it, it was so... It was some... What? Virtue... Virtue. Virtue chick recording me. Is that the first man, Adam? She says with her phone pointed at me. Yeah, babe, what do you want? She gets up and close and touches me. Oh, oh damn. <laughs> Can't a girl say hi to the first dick? She says with her hands moving lower to me. Okay. I didn't know oh, this was oh, getting this. Oh. Whoa, this so is, uh, you're- <laughs> Yeah, this is some crazy shit, dog. Not Adam getting sexually assaulted in a fanfiction right now. <laughs> this is getting a bit sussy. Yeah, this is this is a little sussy baka action right now, holy shit. <laughs> Among us in real life, <laughs> sus. Sus. <laughs> Whoa, hold your horses, I pushed her off of me. I love sex, don't get me wrong, but I- Shit, I don't know what to say. But what? She asks. I, uh, I have a girlfriend. Yeah, that's right. Really? The mighty dick settled down again? Yeah, what's it to you? Uh, nothing, but me and my 30,000 live viewers would love to know who she is. Oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck. Why would I tell you her name, I say as I try to walk away. I take off and try to not think about it. T about the complete bullshit that spat out of my mouth. There's no way there were actually 30,000 live viewers, right? That could be bad. Everyone knew the stories of my wife, so the prospect of me settling down was big news. So this was bad. If it wasn't even- and it wasn't even true. <laughs> <laughs> I leave- when, As I landed at the training grounds, I pull out my phone and- And it's blowing up. Fuck, I'm getting messages left and right. From people congratulating me to confusion to goddamn death threats. Holy shit, dude. People in heaven are batshit crazy. I sneak inside as I don't want any of the girls to catch me and confront me about it. I'm able to get inside my office without any detection. As I close the door to clear... The clarity of what I just did came to me. I can't believe what I just did. I just lied to the entirety of heaven. You know what? You know what would be really cool? Is if, uh, to cover up this lie, you have loot at you and then... That's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, like you go to a very public restaurant and yeah. you drink out of each other's milkshakes. <laughs> yeah, and, and then maybe kiss. <laughs> yeah, and then you hold hands. Yeah, and I don't know. What else do couples do, I guess? <laughs> uh, just the regular cringe. Yeah, be cringy is basically what we're trying to tell you. <laughs> just do that. <laughs> just be lovey dovey. Yeah, be obnoxious about it. Make out in public and make everyone uncomfortable. <laughs> yeah, like Moxie and Millie style. Oh. <laughs> yeah. I can't believe what I did. I, oh yeah. Right when I do, I look over and realize that Luke is fucking asleep. The fuck? She scrolled up on her knees on the floor holding something. Then it hit me. 
What the fuck is Luke gonna think when she finds out? Oh fuck. Oh fuck no. That's it. I'm fucking leaving. <laughs> Me right now with this fanfiction. <laughs> That's it. I'm done. I can't take this assault right now. I need to blow some fucking steam. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go kick a baby. Yeah. Oh my god, me every Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> Specifically Saturday? Yeah, when I go grocery shopping, there's always that one annoying fuck that's in there, so I always like trip a child when I'm in the grocery store. <laughs> Ooh, grocery. This is a grocery store, because that's where you get your groceries. <laughs> I'm not having no, this discussion with you. Get your yet. groceries at the shop. <laughs> well, we don't call it that because that's stupid. <laughs> Hey! No, it's not. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm gonna go to my house and lock myself in there as long as I possibly fucking can. This has become a goddamn nightmare. <sighs> you know what? No. This is a nightmare for me to re Okay. <laughs> yeah. You two are gonna go get married at that restaurant and you're yeah, gonna love it. Yeah. We're gonna arrange that. Just just name drop loot and Luke and just Luke? <laughs> loot. <laughs> what? Just my bad. I, I, got Luke. My, I got my names mixed up. I'm, they're they're literally one letter off. It was bound to happen at some point. Luke, if you're watching this, you're now getting married to Adam. Congratulations. <laughs> He's gonna come and be like, the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> we're marrying you off, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> what is this? Like, we're, we're parents of, like, of, like high royalty. <laughs> yeah, they're just like, yeah, you know, we're just handing you off now because yeah. we need the money. <laughs> oh, the first man family gave us quite a fortune, yes, quite. <laughs> and all you need is your hand in marriage. <laughs> wow. You, you tell, that's exactly the voice that I used to do for, like, Miss Berlin. <laughs> Who the fuck is Miss Berlin? <laughs> the fact that you laughed and you didn't even... <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> um, Inspector Calls. I don't know that one, I'm sorry. <laughs> you, Did you have a live, Phoenix? You're gonna have to send me a picture. <laughs> I Okay, I'm gonna send I'm gonna end up sending you a lot. I need to send you photos of a Toyota in the UK. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, you we, we live like normal photos. people, Phoenix. <laughs> oh, I need to send you everything yeah and you're like so this is what a sidewalk looks like and i'm like whoa that's a sidewalk <laughs> sidewalk it's called a pavement no it's called a sidewalk because you walk on the side of the road all right anyway <laughs> that's, that's... no it's called a pavement because you pave the way for other people <laughs> that's like that's stupid <laughs> <laughs> anyway how did you feel about this reading today i feel a lot better than I did the last time because it feels like we're actually getting somewhere. Yeah. Do you ever feel like a plastic bag drifting through the wind wanting to start again with this? Is is that Katy Perry? No, I think it is it? I think it is. It's maybe your firework. <laughs> I do sometimes feel like a plastic bag. Yeah, honestly me too all the time. <laughs> uh put that in the vent channel. <laughs> We, we need to get a vent channel, channel just to put. <laughs> I just put a monkey's reference. Guys, I'm venting right now. <laughs> Guys, I'm being sauced. <laughs> Alright, I you know what? I'll add it in right after this. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Alright, well, thank you for joining, Sage. I highly appreciate it, even though Yay, we just kept yelling at the book. <laughs> Yep, I, no. you know, you invite me back to these just to torture me, I think. What? No! It's, it's totally not that. It's totally not because I need, need, I need recordings or anything. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I'm just, I'm just free labor for you. You'll get paid eventually. It's... You. You're like my, you're my animator. <laughs> yeah. You can't even say I don't pay you, dog. Yeah. 
Well, anyway, yeah. in in the Discord, you'll find Sage in there, and uh, they they make art. If you want to ask them for a commission and support their efforts of, I don't, what is it you're doing? Getting a house? <laughs> no, that's you. I thought you were also getting a house, like an apartment. No, I already have one. Oh, man, I'm, I'm just, just gaslighting you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all this time you tricked me into thinking I need a new house when I literally just <laughs> moved into one. <laughs> you can help them pay their medical bills and utilities by by getting a piece of art from by them by paying them for it. You know, transactions. <laughs> I like how you say medical bills, but we have free healthcare over here. So. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you can pay for my medical bills if. <laughs> Nuh uh. What the fuck you mean, nuh uh? Nuh uh. Anyway. <laughs> I'm not paying for that. There, there's a bunch of uh, links down there. I won't bother to fucking read off. You guys have eyes. And uh, in, on screen is is the last book club reading that I've done on this channel, including a playlist of all the other Wattpad book club readings if it interests you. Anyway. What's my line again? <laughs> I've only been doing Damn this for it, how Phoenix, long? we were doing so well. Anyway, my name is Phoenix, that was Sage, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye! <laughs>